This is how you use motion guides with the pen tool to control the path of your animation in Adobe Animate. All right, so as you can see, I have the road on one layer, which is gonna be the path that the car travels on. And then I have the car on a separate layer right here. So to start with motion guides, all you have to do is make sure we're clicked on the top layer, the car layer, click the box with the plus in it to create a new layer. We're gonna name that one pen guide. Well, select it on the pen guide layer, go up and actually select your pen tool, which is up here. If you don't see it, click on these three dots and it'll be in here somewhere. You can just drag that into your toolbox or you might right click and see one of these. So then switch to the pen tool. Okay, then all you have to do is click at the very start of our path. So make a dot right there and then click further down the road or down your path and drag out until you kind of bend the path along the path that you want. My suggestion is also then to click on the middle dot right here, boom, that gets rid of the other kind of handle over here, and then click further down the road and do the next one. So I'm gonna drag this one out, bend it like that, click on the middle here, and then continue along the path. So I'm gonna bend this one along there, click on the middle to get rid of the handle, and then just continue along the road until you are done. Once you've completed the path, just go down to the pen guide layer, right click on it and select guide. You're gonna see this like hammer thing show up there. Then just drag the car layer underneath that. You're gonna see kind of indents. Don't have this one with the circle to the left. Do it so it indents like that, let go. You're gonna see the symbol change to this path looking box thing here. Then we're just gonna go up to our free transform tool and drag the car so that little white dot in the middle right there suction cups to that line that we made, to the path. Now you might have to, if I zoom in here, you might have to zoom in to make this happen. Sometimes it doesn't suction cup to it, so zooming in might help with that. Then just go to the corner, so you get this little curvy arrow thing here and rotate the car so it's facing along the path in the direction that you want. Then we're just gonna go to where you want the animation to end. So I'm gonna go to 50 frames here. You're just gonna click on the top one, hold the click down, drag down so all three are highlighted, and then go over here and insert a keyframe. If you don't see this one with the white box and the black circle, right click, you might see one of these other ones. So just click keyframe, that'll put the three dots here. Then click on the car one, so the middle one right here, right click and go up to create classic tween. Now, if we zoom back out and move this over so we can see the end of our path again, all we have to do is go to the last keyframe on the car layer, drag our car over to the very end on this path. So make sure it suction cups to this line as well. Then just go to the corner and rotate it back into place. Now, if we watch it, it's gonna go along that path boom, and in the right direction. But just to make sure it does face the right direction as it's traveling, click within the tween here, like within the purple, go over to your properties, and then down to tweening, it might be closed down like this, into tweening, and just select orient to path. So I'm gonna uncheck it, just so you can see the difference. So if you uncheck it, it might look like this, the car is gonna be going all like wonky. So make sure that you click in between, like somewhere in the middle here, and then check off orient to path, and that'll make sure it heads in the right direction. For a more detailed tutorial on motion guides in Adobe Animate, make sure to check out the links in the description below. Dad! Dad! Guess what? What? Superfly! Superfly. Oh my goodness! How did that happen? Because you realize that I'm gonna add this right into the middle of my this tutorial that I'm recording one. right now. Potter is it really everyone do you realize this that this is a harry potter wand that just came into my room here two of them no this is here you have you have two sammy mm. no, this is did you go buy sammy. that with mom yeah and that's no that's one of harry's friends wand oh okay so you have Stupefy! Harry. oh my goodness stupefy Okay, can I continue recording? Close the door, please.